Shadow, show the camera, Shadow, show the camera. You are not to beat your opponent. <laughs> <laughs> you are to beat your opponent. <laughs> Hey guys, this is What The Heck Reviews, and today we'll be unboxing Dojo Battle, Fight Like a High Tech Ninja. CJ, how do you think this game is going to play out? I'm not a real Dojo Master, but it says the instructions on the back. It says, track your hit points, which I feel like that means health, and multiple battle modes, where you can switch the battle mode. Real battle sounds, which meant like battle effect and sounds up. Uh, Choose your dojo color. I don't know if that means it will change the color of your sword. But the cool thing is that it says two wait well two player battle ready right away, but you don't want to leave your friends out. Yeah. So we're gonna be unboxing this. Also, just for your information, this is the real length of the sword. So let's just get right into it. Right into it. Now that we've gotten the swords out, we can start pulling out the chest plates. We have one chest plate. Also, I... And the colors. And another chest plate. And chest plate, too. No. So, the way I think we should put these on is that you need batteries. You could be the blue dojo, orange dojo, or red dojo. Somehow this guy did not manage to get it in there. You just need to get this and stick it in the top. It slides in perfectly. Battery's not included for your information. So you're gonna need those six AAA batteries that we were saving, as you can see. So the power button's on the back of the device, and it has two levels, one hit or two hits. This is how one hit mode works. Do it to one, one energy. It's on one energy right now. CJ, hit it. There's one, hit it again, CJ. There's two, and hit it again. There's three. It resets with the button on the front. And this is two hit mode. Look at him, fella. It's yellow. It's red. Stop it's yellow. light. It's red. Yellow. Red. Me and my brother always got along, but I always felt like he was a little bit jealous of me. I noticed I was a little bit ahead of my brother, and that's when I realized we were never on the same page. Why couldn't that child just accept all of my skill? Wait a minute, I hear something.
Oh, nice. So, what do you think about this game? I give it a 10 out of 10. And uh, I, I feel like this game helps you out with that type of stuff. And more than likely, he's reading accuracy, dexterity, endurance. Oh, and defense. Like defense, how, how you make sure you don't get hit and stuff. All right, what do you think about the game and what do you rate it? Well, I think this game is pretty good. Because like a lot of the other games that we reviewed, this game is not broken easily. And also it's very simple. Maybe one of the swords is maybe a little bit wiggly. And paint comes off these swords a little bit easily. There's a few marks on here. But otherwise this game is great. It, it doesn't really require anything other than this and a few batteries. Also, this game will help you with, um, well, keeping up your defense and never letting your guard down. Don't be too on edge, but it'll help you like stay on close enough to the edge. I think I'd write this game a 10 because it gets you off the couch and out the house. See, you can play it indoors if you would like, but... I think it's better outdoors because you have more space to run around. So yeah, what would you rate this game? I rate this game a 10 out of 10. Like he said, off the couch, out the house. Um, also, it helps your skills. Yeah, it helps you keep up your defense and almost never let your guard down. And what is the name of this channel? This is? This is What the, what the Heck, heck reviews. reviews. Make sure to subscribe, ring that bell, and smash the like button. Oh, comments below. Don't okay, forget leave your comments down below on what you think. Ooh. We'll see you next time on What the Heck Reviews. <laughs> Are you ready? My family has escaped. Your family will not escape. You will perish. <clears throat> I'm God. Okay. <laughs> <laughs>